And now to my left, the head, not of Random House, but of our house. My favorite baritone is replacing Bennett tonight. And now the uh, actor-producer who is about to appear in Metro's new picture, Tip on a Dead Jockey, my own personal live wire. And now the famous Professor Moriarty from Baker Street, a devil on stage, an angel at home. And now a gentleman who is wearing a bachelor button as a boutonniere, which doesn't fool me for one minute. And now a gentleman who's... <laughs> whose reviews in the new Broadway hit, The Rivalry, were so brilliant that I have to devote the rest of my life putting these reviews to music. I want to introduce to you the man that bought me this hat. <laughs> and now I am about to introduce a gentleman whom I am about to lose to the lady he is about to introduce. And now a gentleman with whom I have just spent a glorious vacation, a week's vacation on a Frank Sinatra yachting party. Wow! <laughs> the captain of my own particular ship. And now, a gentleman I have spent 21 happy years with this very week, Mr. Martin Gable. <laughs> Me too, Arlene. I was hoping so. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> On my left, a girl who's first in war, first in peace, and first in our house. Uh, as I have been so described, I'm rather timid about introducing the lady on my left, but you all know her. My poor wife, I really had every intention of coming back all the time. <laughs> and here she is, happy, bright-eyed, gay. And on my left, Bennett Serf's next-door neighbor. And on my left, a young woman who's making her first appearance in television since yesterday. On my left, a girl who's getting up very early in the morning to allow Dave Garraway to have a vacation. What I have to say about the girl of my, on my left uh, is as brilliantly simple as her new comedy hit in the films, One, Two, Three. On my left, a lady who has asked me to say that the condition of her eye is in no way any fault of mine. My wife. On my left, a woman who's commuting so much between New York and California that the only time I get a chance to spend a half hour with her is on this program. On my left, a girl you see far more often than I do, the perfect <laughs> wife. On my left, the first and last Mrs. Gable, Miss Arlene Francis. I'm glad to hear that. <laughs> you come my place later, Martin. <laughs> yes, dear. I know my place. Thank you, John. Good night. Martin, don't let me catch you in Miami having your picture taken. Good night. <laughs> night, Arlene. That is uh, for the moment. I think I finally know you. I can see beyond your smile. I think that I can show you that what we have is still worth the while. Don't you know that love's just like the thread that keeps
Ketika 